Greetings and welcome to Cheap Joe's Workshops. I'm Joe and this is my brother and wonderful friend Chinky Chi. And we're so honored to have him here to teach and to uh, help students. And he would tell you he's not a teacher, but he is a wonderful teacher. And Chinky, welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Brother Joe. Well, you say I'm a teacher and uh, just because you're a brother, but I never consider myself a teacher. I'm just a fellow artist here, sharing my experience with fellow artists. Well, you have wonderful experience and a wonderful artist and just my favorite friend in the whole world, Chin Ki Chi and his wife, Sing B. And he does a fabulous workshop. And I'll let him tell you a little bit about what he does in the workshop. Um, well, the workshop, I, I do usually five-day workshops, and uh, each day uh, we, I share with the participants a new concept. So uh, the five days, the first day, of course, we deal with the traditional academic approach, then, of course, everybody's familiar with. Uh, second day, we deal with the saturated wet process that we use for painting things like uh, fish, like flowers, like different type of things, because what? Easy lifting, okay? When you work on wet paper, keep the paper wet all the time. In the whole process of painting, then you can lift out. You can wipe out paint at will. So number three, third day, then we work with uh, illustration board, smooth illustration board. Uh, Treat it with gel medium in order to get the uh, texture effect, not effortlessly. Right? Right. So you don't have to know anything, just let the medium work for you. Uh, that I use that for painting rock formations, and uh, I use for painting mountains and that type of thing. Okay, number four, four day is that I try to introduce some uh, Eastern way of painting, uh, crinkling the uh, paper using rice paper, masa paper, and crinkle it up to get texture. I use that for painting tree forms. Uh, the last day we do marbleize, marbleizing. We do marbleizing uh, technique and uh, to to get the kind of images that it usually is a dreamy type of thing, um, uh, abstract, but then uh, highly spiritual. So to express spiritual, uh, visionary uh, type of feeling. So that's wrapped up with all the five days. Uh, the idea is that if you ask me uh, what the title of your, <laughs> your workshop, I would say watercolors, synthesizing East and West. That's the main idea behind that. Um, I, um, I was born in China and grew up in uh, Southeast Asia. I'm familiar with the Eastern way of painting. Then, of course, later on, I came to the United States and I picked up the Western style. So my idea is that to combine both East and West, Eastern ideas and process and with the Western ideas and process. So we use uh, material of both sides. We use regular watercolor paper like uh, Kali Manjaro, <laughs> and of course American Journey, uh, the um, uh, watercolor. Then at the same time we use uh, rice paper, uh, oriental ink, and brushes. So try to uh, combine those two. And I hope that uh, people enjoyed that. Oh, people love Chinky. We love Chinky. And it's a spiritual experience being here with him and being in his presence. And if you ever have the opportunity to be with him, don't miss it. It's wonderful. Chinky and I have been friends for many years. And uh, we met at a workshop called Kanuga, I believe. That's right, Kanuga. And I instantly became... a. a uh, how do well, I say it? You were in a workshop. You were in a I workshop. was in his workshop yeah. and uh, just had the most wonderful experience. And then we, we really did become brothers. It was a joke how we became brothers, but okay. since then we have become very good friends and brothers and uh, have remained friends and will throughout our lives. Well, at first, of course, it's all make-believe, you know, yes. but now, you see, all my biological brothers are gone, so uh, this is the only brother I can lean <laughs> on it. So it became, uh, what the feelings are real. Yes. So you are my brother. Yes, and you can see the resemblance with our hair. <laughs> That's right. See, it's, uh, well, the reason is, uh, oh, you took, you took, you, you returned it to me. Okay, yes. I'll put it on. I'm, I'm making brushes from my mustache. This is the first day without it, so that's how we 
way bad. Coming to Bund is just like home coming to me, you know, coming home to my brother's house. And then this is the best facility that I have encountered now, although I did not do, say, 30 workshops of 25 or so, so many workshops. I do only six workshops a year, or a period well of 10, and I cannot find any other place that can match this. I mean, the Chinese has a saying, good things happen when three things are complete. That means that uh, the environment, uh, the, um, uh, the human um, uh, element, and then the timing. Now the place here is wonderful. This is the best facility. It's, it's built for that purpose. Uh, light, good lighting, uh, very generous space, and everything is here. And better yet, you know, you don't have to bring your uh, supplies. <laughs> It's all free. Just go in there and, 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 and pick up whatever you like it and just charge it. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about human uh, element. I mean, who, you know, where can, and can match our brother Joe? He's the most caring, most generous person that I know. You know, you give everybody free lunch <laughs> and occasionally free dinner. I mean, where do you find things like that? See, and I learned this from my brother, Chinky. So that's how I learned this. <laughs> and uh, I, I, I predict that uh, uh, Boon Chip Joe's watercolor uh, workshop will become the mecca of watercolor media. So I thoroughly enjoy to stay here. And to be to be honest with you, I'm reluctant to go back home. I uh, want to move in with you. I want you to move in with me. We'll keep you. <laughs> we will just keep you here. I, I, all, all I need is a, a corner in your garage, you know. <laughs> and uh, and uh, the summer you, you have like, you have the king's room. <laughs> this is my king, king of watercolor. Uh, thank you, brother. Chinkichi. Now, now this is documented. You know? <laughs>